Hi there, it's Chris Hamilton here with salestipaday.com and today I'm going to show you how to make an electronic card or a V card in Microsoft Outlook and it's quite easy. Go to your contacts section and go up here and hit new and what you do is you actually fill out all the information for yourself in uh, your uh, Outlook uh, contact file. So you put your business information, put your phone numbers, your emails, your web page, any kind of information that you want. One thing I uh, caution you against is don't add any personal information in here. So um, just for an example, I'm going to bring up my V card that I have and you'll be able to see it and here it is right here and I actually included a nice picture of Mario in here that does not meet, look like me by any means but anyways um, what you see is um, I filled out uh, just the relative information I haven't put my address in or anything like that and this is now saved in my Outlook but then what you want to do is you go up in this upper corner here and you go save as and export to vCard file and I usually would save it on my desktop here uh, I do have a copy actually saved on my desktop but I'll just save that and overwrite it right now and so now I've got this sitting in Outlook but I also have what they call a virtual card or a V card uh, out on my desktop and uh, one of the things that you could do with that is anytime you're sending an email off and you want to actually attach your uh, contact information you can attach it via um, uh, a, uh, a card to attach if you want. So you go into Outlook and then in here in the include you can include a uh, business card if you want. So you go click here. So it did bring that up and put it in here. One other way that I find useful, uh, although I don't do it on my current uh, consulting job with the uh, company I'm with, uh, is to actually attach it right into the signature file. So go into tools, go into options, and go into mail format up here. Down here you'll see signatures. So this is where you can put your signature file in. So I've basically got my signature information in here for the company I'm consulting with right now. And what you want to do is you go into the business cards up here. So make sure that you go into that stuff, follow how it was, uh, how I got you here. Go in here and I will go through and pull up my uh, card here when I find it. Uh, there it is. And I will say OK and bring that in. So now what happens is anytime I will save that, anytime I create an email, uh, it is going to automatically bring that information up. So it'll attach my V card into the file and then also put some information down below so that uh, people have your file. Um, one thing also to caution against this though is sometimes spam filters will catch this stuff and not allow it through. So anyways, it's a way of getting your name and uh, information, contact information out to people at any given time because they can actually open this and save it into Outlook if they want and put it in their contacts. So there's how you create a V card, attach it to your emails and uh, get your name out there and make sure that it's uh, uh, people get the information that they're uh, supposed to get from you. So for useful daily uh, sales and marketing tips, go to www.salestipaday or if you feel like emailing me, please email me at chris at salestipaday.com. Thanks for viewing.